<laughs> my name's Spider World of Simulation. Hi. It's me. I'm playing. I'm playing Lisa. I played. Okay. This is the tea. Okay, look. I played the Lisa game a long time ago when it was just called Lisa. Now it's called Lisa the First, I think. I really liked it. I remember. I still. It's still. I still remember it to this day. I played so many of those, like, RPG Maker games. The walking simulators. And that was definitely one of my. Bruh! Hi, Tyson Teen! <laughs> How are you? I might be blocking the game too. I'm not sure. What's up? What's up? Okay, so I'm playing. I honestly, I'm going in blind. I really don't know what to expect. I I knew there were like sequels to the game, but I don't really know anything about them. In the walking simulator game, you know, those tend to be um, kind of vague. But I feel like uh, I remember it kind of having like a plot. I don't know. I don't. <laughs> hello there. That guy. Hello. You guys are kind of scaring me right now. <laughs> Anyways, I really don't know what to expect from this game. Um, also, I'm sorry, I don't know how to get the captions to work. <laughs> I don't know why I'm nervous today, too. I'm nervous to stream today. Anyways. <laughs> I never played this. Uh, I don't know what to expect. <laughs> Let me know if it's loud for you guys, too. It's loud for me. It scared me. New game, new me, yeah. Well, technically, I played the first one a long time ago, but... Ow. <laughs> you little thief. Stop. Stop. Leave him alone. <clears throat> Sorry, because it woke up. Shut up, Brad. He stole our ball. What's this game? It's called... Okay, look, I played the first one. It was like a walking simulator a long time ago, and it was called Lisa, but now it's called... It was renamed Lisa the First because there's like 500 of them now. There's like a bunch of sequels. <laughs> That's all I know. That's all I know. This is not a walking simulator. The The first one was a walking simulator. I stole it. Rick didn't do anything. What? You little... Walking simulator? Yeah, you know, walking simulator. It is. Let's go, guys. You know, when you walk around and you, uh, it's like video games where you walk around and you have to find little objects and stuff that, like, trigger things and, like, you could walk in a supermarket. <laughs> it's the first of that type of game. The first of that type of game. Like Frambo. Um, not like Frambo. Frambo, it does, usually walking simulators don't have a lot of dialogue or like characters. Like, um, all the walking simulators I know are not very like well known. So I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, like you <laughs> like that. Like there's another one. There was another one that a lot of people played. What was it called? Like, it was called The Disappearance of Somebody or something like that. Oh, yeah? Um, people usually say it, like, insultingly, but I genuinely love walking simulators. <laughs> I really like that kind of game. Let's go, guys. <laughs> Let me know if my character's blocking anything too much. I can make myself smaller. Let me take a peek. Actually, let me, let me take a peek at my OBS. Let me see. I'm covering Brad, I think. I don't know who's Brad. Yeah, I'm covering Brad. My bad. Yeah. Okay, hold on. I'll make myself small. Wait, where's OBS? <laughs> I have like three things open and I'm already overwhelmed. <laughs> See, should I make myself smaller? Guys, I'm shrinking. I'm shrinking. Is that good, guys? Should I go here? Come on. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. I'm thinking too much. Oh. It's me. Who am I? 
there's a person up there. How do I interact? Sorry, you got beat up. I creep. You scared me. You guys are really getting me today. No, nope, locked. Locked. I just got the bread. <laughs> locked. It was too quiet. Make sure. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Thank you. everyone's doing well. Welcome to my new schedule. <laughs> this one? Found it. Oh, I remember this room from the other game. Oh. Uh-oh. Once again, my son steps into my house. Beat two. Beep. <laughs> I don't want to close some feet, guys. I'm alert for 30 minutes. Currently watching a show. I found Netflix. Oh, nice. Should I curse today? Oh. Your schedule is starting at 4.30 a.m. Did you move countries? Yes. Temporarily. I'm in the UK for two months. <laughs> it's 9.52 a.m. for me. I'm not buying you another shirt. Worthless. Oop, kid. I'll say poop. I'll say poop, guys. <laughs> Go to your room. Now. Back to sleep. Good night. It's locked. That's my room. How many meals have beans on them over there? I had breakfast with beans one time. And I had dinner with beans one time, so so far two. I've only been here. Lisa. Oh. You took some joy. What the hell? <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> uh... <laughs> it's okay, little buddy. <laughs> oh, oh my god. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, baby. Sorry. It's okay, it's okay. You shouldn't really be throwing baby. <laughs> okay, death guy. It's okay. They were... 90? I ate beans. I ate... I had some chocolate. That was good. It was good. It was called Wisp Wispo or something. Wisp Wispa. Yeah. I gotta write down a list of all the foods I tried and I'll review them for you. You guys, I could do a movie review. I watched three movies on the plane. I could do movie reviews for you guys. Come on, little buddy. <laughs> Let's get you somewhere safe. Oh, that was not a nine. That was a G. It didn't say 90. It said go. I found a baby, guys. trip. Okay, good. We're, good. We're safe. Are those the friends from before? Brad? What is that? Holy poop. Is that a baby? Yeah. Whoa. A baby? Where did you get that? I don't know. I just found it lying on the ground. Jeez. 
dudes, wait. You know what this means? This means there's a girl out there. Whoa. That means there's hope for humanity. Whoa. I bet she's super hot. <laughs> totally. Guys, this is serious. Is it a boy or a girl? I didn't check. It's a girl. Wow. We need to tell someone. Rando. If we came to him with this, we'd be set for life. All the food and cool stuff we want. Dope, dude. That's actually not a bad idea. The Rando army would be better equipped for something like this. No. No one can know I have her. She's a baby now, but she'll be a woman in no time. She wouldn't stand a chance out there. Aww. Brad, that's insane. You'll keep her a secret your whole life? Do you know what would happen if anyone found out? I don't care. I'm keeping her. Brad. I don't care if you guys help me or not. I'm not gonna give her up. This is my second chance. Jeez, Brad. Don't worry, little buddy. I won't let anyone hurt you. Schedule. Next week, next week I'll have, I'll have a schedule. Get ready. I just realized I forgot to... I forgot to put my schedule template on this laptop. I'll make one in MS Paint maybe, I don't know. making a little room under there make one in microsoft powerpoint that's actually not a bad idea oh wait i don't have microsoft powerpoint dang maybe on my work laptop i could download it yeah Oh, she's a little kid now. Google Slides. <laughs> Wait, true. That's free. True. Oh, well, she could go out if she has a disguise. party. <laughs> Am I blocking it?
<gasps> that scared me. Hey, you there. This wild beast won't leave me alone. I'd slay him myself, but I pulled my groin climbing this tree. <laughs> Just give me a hand, will ya? Oh. <laughs> fight. I have to fight a little dog? Gang won the battle. What on earth? I didn't expect that. <laughs> You're pretty tough for a whacked out midlife crisis looking bald guy. You seem like you could handle a lot of pain. Like, maybe you could handle some kind of pain related difficulty setting, huh? Am I correct? No, normal, please. Ha, <laughs> huh, that sucks. Anyway, I would have helped, but like I said, I hurt my string. I'm Terry Hins. People call me the Lord of the Tutorial. <laughs> I've been traveling the lands, leaving my hints for all to see. I'm pretty big deal. Got a lot of fans. Wait. You seem pretty lonely. Since I'm a nice guy, I'll keep you company. Cool, it's settled. <laughs> we got a party member, let's go. If this balloon wasn't here, you would walk off the cliff and die. This balloon just saved your life. Awesome. Can I jump? Bottles. Bottles can be very useful. You can sell them, fill them, or make fire bombs with them, or even just throw them in battle. So pick them up. Terry. Thanks, Terry. Oh. Saving. You can save your game by consulting a crow. Somebody's gotta remember ya. Jumping. Yeah, I wanna know how to jump. Well, you can hold. Oh, and then. Okay, I see. And then hold that to drop down. Okay. Be wary of Terry's good looks. They're dangerously appealing. Always looking out. Is the game really loud, or is it just me? Resting. If you find a campfire, you can rest. You probably will be fully revived, but be careful. You're vulnerable when you're sleeping. Anything can happen, but what choice do you have? Sweet Terry wine. I guess I'll give it a try. Secrets out, Brad. No! She's gone. <gasps> no, his friend. Sorry, guy. There's something I gotta do. Alone. 
What happened? I can't really tell you. Come on, bro. This looks serious. Someone close to me is missing. I need to find that person. That's really all I could say. Oh, shoot. That sad dude. Oops. Excellent. Skipped one. I figure you'll need someone to protect you. I don't. I'll tag along, I guess. Considering I'm a very strong warrior. <laughs> Terry has joined you. Again! Thank you, Terry. I appreciate it. He's dead. Dang. Oh my gosh, he's dead. He's dead. Found a rusty knife. Oh my god. He's dead, yeah. holding something. Diet uh, co cola cola. Thank you. Interesting. Found a mystery jerky. go back? Wait, I didn't try to go this way. Whoop. Oh, my bad. <gasps> Wait, there's something there. More jerky. Combos. Some characters can use combos in battle via the WASD buttons. Additional special attacks can be performed by entering a specific combo. In your skills menu, you can find out how to do special moves by looking at the button sequence. Uh, WWS does buster punches. I'm going to have to write this one down, guys. I'm going to have to write this one down. Hope I... I'm not gonna remember that. I'm gonna be honest. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. I'm trying to open this thing. It has sticky notes. W W S. I'm too old to remember combos, guys. I can't do this. Okay. Alright, combos are good. Does that make sense? Yes, it does. Okay, so if I go to skills... Okay, so that's Brad. And then does Terry have any? Little cheer? He does. Mm. I can't see them, though. Mm, weapon. Sweaty wristbands. Can we pick up a knife? Maybe Terry wants the knife. Don't have the knife. Weapons. Yeah, look. Don't use this on your dinner. You'll get sick. Can't use it. Oh, maybe it's for someone else that we didn't get yet. I guess I'll try my one combo. 
out of my way. I want that little all to myself. Oh my god. Get him. <laughs> Thanks, Terry. Very helpful. Very cool. I don't think the combo worked, guys. Anyway. W, W, S. That's an A! I'm dumb. Oh, wait, I did it wrong. <laughs> That's why it didn't work. Yeah. You know what? For some reason, I was trying to use my arrows instead of my uh, keyboard. Did you, he's crying on him. Accuracy goes down. He can't do anything. Oh, I could just do that instead of the actual combo. Soul salmon swimming downstream tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Terry, shout out to all my fans. Thank you, Terry. <laughs> Terry leveled up. <laughs> well, I'm winded. Hey. That was pretty rough. You really held your own. But. It's only going to get tougher from here. Countless traps, monsters, karate, politics? Vehicular manslaughter? Sometimes even best friends can die. Just be safe, you better take this. You got... Terry's Terroids. <laughs> Access this item from your key items menu. How else do you think I got these big... <laughs> Bugler? Bulgers? On my chest, arms, neck, back, and crack. <laughs> Just kidding, but seriously. Take it from me, bro. You gotta work smarter, not harder. If the going gets tough, get to meetings will activate painless mode. It's an easier difficulty mode that makes battles a breeze. Oh. The only downside is the irreversible per per permanenti. There's no coming back from it. <laughs> Gaining those powerful pep pe people pleasers will be a lifetime contract for normal people like you, of course. I was mirac miraculously able to kick the habit on account of the fact that I got a willpower made of solid 100% pure terium. <laughs> then you can, like, yeah, I made my schedule as a Minecraft Pixar build. <laughs> you could. Like, oh my god. I think that would take me all week to do. Let's get going. Is Terry still chilling with us? It's kind of dark in here. I can't believe it. Such a ugly girl. Dead. He's dead. I'm just checking, you know. He's dead. Hey, I'm not dead yet. <laughs> Come here so I can kick your ass. <laughs> That's right, tough guy. You fell right into my trap. <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm bleeding. Thank you, Terry. The hinster's moving on up. We got some sick drops. Okay. Goodbye. The mattress will catch me. Oh, maybe I should use the jerky to heal. Alright men, I'm gonna stay here and block the entrance. You guys go search around in case she's already been through here. You got it, boss. Sugar boy drifters out. Is this a joke, bald man? You think you can handle what's going on out there? I'll give you a taste. Health. 
<laughs> Hopefully he's already dead, so I could hear her in hell. Here's a hint, you suck, I rule. <laughs> I was struggling a little there. Oh my god. He's, uh... I could save. Get off my. Need to get off. My, oh. Okay. Oh yeah, I knew that. Hmm. A helmet. to the old college try if the old college try with this bad boy why can i wear it hmm. <laughs> you suffered serious damage time is a great teacher sadly it kills all of its pupils <laughs> spent as we lads it was the bully my heart just tumbles with joy thinking about it like your head in a dryer normally you'd be dead and stripped of your wares by now but i like you brad let's have some fun i shall give you a choice your yellow shirted friend's life or all of your belongings choose wisely what will you give of course my belongings I would never give up my boy Terry. Hmm, how boring. Alright boys, strip him quickly. I hear tale that a female is on the loose. My my points ache for some excitement. Off we go. All your stuff has been taken. I'm not giving up on Terry. Terry, you good? Ugh. My head. Whoa, you look like hell. Are you okay, dude? What happened? Um, we got hit by a truck. It was some old friends. Everything's okay now. Damn, first my hamstrings on this. <laughs> You're a bad omen. Yeah, I guess so. Well, it's all good, man. I don't mind. I like hanging out with you. Yay, Terry! <laughs> Terry can join you. Again? <laughs> what the flip? How was I supposed to know that was going to happen? like a storm is brewing around here. You look tired. Are you hungry? If you have an empty bottle, you can have some, some of my soup. If you need to rest, you can use my tent. Thank you. That's really nice. Oh! You suffered a serious head injury. Your SP has decreased. Your luck has decreased. Is he okay? He's knocked out. Alright, I'm not gonna seal his soup then. Man. You 
can have some of my poison berries. Whoa. Holy heck. Oh my gosh. Scare stops you wary, weird, stun, cry. Scares your vision. Cool. <laughs> Stink. Hangover drunk. Cool pick, huh? I think I'm gonna backtrack and go to the thing over here. Can I hop this? That's an exit. Uh oh. Am I stuck? What do I do? What do I do? How do I go back? Ah. I've messed up. I'm about to die. Oh, I'm good. See the red skulls? It means... Rando's army has taken over, which sucks. Because only gasoline... The only gasoline within miles is in there. How the hell am I supposed to make firebombs? Oh. It's so dark. We fighting. I think. Oh. Bring her to Rando, he will give you the world. So weird. Uh. Hi. Okay, bye. Yo. Where are you going? Get over here. Hey, Lance, leave him alone. Rando doesn't want a startling. Starting poop for no reason. I said get it over here now. Oh. Look at his little legs. We 
got a problem here. All of them? No. I'm back here. I'm not going down there this time. Oh wait, I literally- I don't have any other choice, do I? I could skip it. Oh, I can't go up there. I thought I could- Wait, no! <laughs> Maybe I could have jumped on that box. Why am I dumb? Why am I doing the same thing again? Let me try. See? I'm done. Leave. Take your pervert war elsewhere. I want no part in this. Oh. I don't know why I thought that'd be exciting. Are you okay? What's wrong? Getting sentimental, brother? Uh, no, just asking. Uh-oh. Here it comes. <laughs> I'm closing my eyes. Good night, Olaf. Uh, bye. Lucas gave his final breath. Rip. Not sure what that was about. <laughs> anyway, a whole mob of guys ran through here going on about a girl. A balding guy in pink and a <laughs> clad man in green cut the bridge out. He looked really scared, neither of them fit for battle. Everyone got pissed and started to leave. Then all of a sudden, there three dudes with amazing hair found the girl. Apparently, she was in that truck. Pretty crazy, huh? They invited everyone back to their clubhouse in the old factory. I didn't go. That chick looked ugly. It's locked. The bridge is out. Maybe we'll try a different door this time. So I don't have to fight that gang. It's brighter in this one. Oh. The girl's just up ahead. She's in the old clubhouse. But those pretty boy kicked me out. Now I'm gonna get the pretty out of view. What? It's just one person this time. But he has a knife. How much 
Oh, we have coin. I gave them all up for Terry. Oh. <laughs> I need some healing. Maybe I should have sold that guy soup. I don't know. I don't want to be a jerk though. Oh no, we're out. <laughs> Wait, no guard. Oh, he threw a bottle at him. Terry could take, take a hit. can save after this fight. I mean, I guess I could, but I would have to get past that other guy that was, like, hiding. I'm just assuming he was sort of fighting. We learned that she's in there. Maybe we should try the third door. Here, let me trigger that uh, thing again. Now let's talk to this guy. Let's see what he says. I've been I've been avoiding him, but maybe he's not that bad.
contestants are in disarray. <laughs> Do we get new loot? We got a new skill. Oh, we got we got Coca Cola. Here, let me see. All right, let's see how we are doing. Throw it at someone. They won't. It won't hurt. It's a soft drink. <laughs> okay, it's for SP. I see. Okay. All right. I return. Welcome back, Death Guy. Here, let me trigger all the um dialogue that I did before because I don't know if that makes a difference or not. Well, now I don't have to get hurt when I go down. Oh, I guess I could get a bottle. I'm just gonna skip through this because we're almost ready. I'll save and I'll try to get that bottle. I'll see how that goes. Okay. So, let's save. Let's try to see if we get that bottle. I don't know if it's worth it. Oh, I'm in a little thing. Are you kidding me? Oh wait, where am I now? Tommy, don't play with matches. How do you even get those, sport? <laughs> Give them to- oh. What do you want? I'm looking for a child? This is my orphanage. All the kids have been abandoned. Taking care of them because no one else will. Why are you- Uh oh, Tommy! He threw the fire! Now look what you did! It's okay, sport. I'll get- I'll get that put out. Hey, could you hand me that bucket of water? Oh, you fool! Not that bucket! That was my gasoline bucket! Oh, so cool. No! Get that bucket of water quick! Oh my gosh! The, the orphans! The orphans! No! The orphans! The orphans! No! I killed the orphans! Guys! You were too late. This is the second most tragic thing to happen in my life. What happened since I left? Um, his adopted daughter got kidnapped and we're trying to save her. And I, I, um, I just killed all the orphans. Guys. How was I supposed to know? Okay, so this one leads to that gang. This one leads to the club where the girl is. I don't know what this is. <gasps> Jesus, give me! A worm? We're fighting a worm. I think it's supposed to be a snake, actually. Oh, he bit me. I don't want to be here anymore. To be fair, why was that bucket of gasoline closer than the bucket of water? I don't know. Little che- Oh, wait, what's this? Form. I don't think I can win against this snake. He's really- 
really powerful. I'm gonna die. <laughs> yeah. The orphans are saved, guys. Okay, and then what did- I guess we'll find out what this one does. Wait, did I trigger that thing? I did, I did, okay. Is that bottle worth it? I don't know. I really don't know. Let's see where this one goes. Decapitated man. Yeah, I think so. Oh, hello there. My name is Nern. I'm considered the greatest historian of our time. I've gathered a wealth of knowledge about Olaf and what happened. Many tales. Would you like to hear? Um, sure. I'll hear some lore. Hmm. I wish you were more enthusiastic. Oh, well. I'll tell you anyway. Let's see. All right, it all started with that, what I like to call the Flash. This is starting to seem like a kind of game. Yeah, this is actually like more Wong than I expected. I was sitting with my wife, God rest her soul, sipping on sweet lemon tea. I believe it was homemade by my sweet wife, God rest her soul. Oh, or wait, maybe she bought it from the store in a bottle. You know, like a plastic bottle? Well, hold on now. That would be ridiculous to buy a bottle of sweet lemon tea and transfer the contents into a glass. Why not just drink it from the bottle? I guess maybe she be nice in the glass? But then again, making tea homemade would be just as time consuming, if not more. That sneaky bee. <laughs> anyway, I'll save that story for later. The flash, like the person? I think it was like a bomb. I think it's like a post-apocalyptic world. So I'm sitting on my porch drinking sweet lemon tea from a glass, of course, ho ho, when suddenly a great strangeness fills my body. Something was wrong. I've lived many years, and I've never felt something like this before. Did you know what it was? Yep, it was my rocking chair. That wooden son of a gun stopped rocking. So I looked down and realized the rock had gotten caught beneath my chair. A rock under my rocking chair. <laughs> what a day. I decided it was time for bed. I had a little bit too much excitement for one day. Ho ho. <laughs> I slid into my jammies, brushed my teeth, and said my prayers. As I was climbing onto bed, I noticed my wife, God rest her soul, brushing her hair in the bathroom. As I peered across the hall, my body swelled up with emotion. Why can't I be married to an attractive woman? <laughs> what the heck? Is it me? My bank account? I'm a tall guy. I work 40 minutes a week. <laughs> Is that not enough? Now my neighbor at the time, Tom Fork Forknight, was very short. His wife, Karen Forknight Plate Burger. Yeah, one of those women. Well, she was more attractive than my wife. I'd say she was a soft six, whereas my wife was a hard four. <laughs> What's the deal? I thought women liked tall men. <laughs> Why was Karen with me? <laughs> Wait, but I want to know the lore of the freaking world. Anyway, my horse of white, God rest her soul, crawled into bed next to me. She decided to leave the bedside light on so she could read her book. It was one of her romance novels again. Give me a break. As if I don't already feel inadequate enough. Not only do I have to compete with Tom, I have to deal with these fictional hunks. Hey, yay, yay, yay. Yeah, yeah. At this point, I had already suppressed the urges of intimacy. I rolled over and tried to sleep. <laughs> Her bedside light was only a minor annoyance. I was able to drift off. Then, I woke up to a big flash of light. Here we go. That's about it. <sighs> Why? <laughs> Are you kidding me? 
I can tell by the way you're walking away that you don't want to leave. Oh no. <laughs> if you really want to hear another story, I'll tell you. Once upon a hot summer night, sometime in July. Was it July? My local grocery store sells really good eggs in July. I don't know why. Do chickens operate better in heat? Fireworks, maybe? I don't know. Don't want to get off topic. Point is, the eggs that summer were marvelous. Anyway, my wife and I, God rest her soul, went to a barbecue that night. It was held at Dale Spoon Spooner's house. Well, his backyard. Connie Spooner doesn't want people in her home. I think she's just an uptight bee. So, at this barbecue, I see none other than, that's right, Tom Fork Night. Now, earlier in the day, my wife, God rest her soul, had made potato salad for the barbecue. Personally, I hate potato salad. I'm a mashed kind of fellow. Ho ho. So, I sat in the TV room, avoiding her, till the barbecue. Once we were at the party, I made sure to see myself from my dumb potato people. <laughs> God rest her soul. I didn't want anyone to think I would associate with someone that would bring a potato salad. Anyway, Tom and his above mediocre wife were already there. <laughs> the amount of times this guy said God rest her soul is kind of sus. I know, right? And get this. They brought a fruit salad with whipped cream. The nerve of the pork knights. Needless to say, I gave my wife, God rest her soul, a couple of words about whipped cream versus potato salad. Son of a bee. The real tongue lashing. A real tongue lashing. Yeah, they really... Yeah, they did outdo them at the barbecue, I can't lie. I wouldn't be surprised if the reason his wife gone had something to do with him. I think it has to do with the apocalypse, because only men survive for some reason, I think. I don't know. I don't know the lore yet. Hello again! Grr. I was gonna tell another story. I need more water. This guy's making my mouth dry. I'm reading too much. Funny seeing you here. What, are you following me or something? Ho ho. Anyway. I often wonder what all happened here. What was that big flash? Why are we here? Even our night and day cycle is odd. Sometimes days last ages and nights come rarely. And then those clouds, so strange. What happened to our Earth? Well, oh well, enough of boring stuff. Once I had a real kooky day at the doctor's office. I was in the waiting room reading a teen magazine. Normally, I don't indulge in adolescent publications, but I couldn't resist. I had recently heard the new artist on the radio, Ulysses U Utensils. She was some young woman, maybe a boy, I don't know. Either way, that child can really grasp my attention. So I'm reading this magazine because I saw Ulysses on the counter. I still wasn't able to identify if it was a man or a woman, but as I was reading, I noticed something on the ceiling. I look up and see that there's some water damage. You'd think a doctor would make enough money to maintain his office. I guess he cares about his cool jeskies more than his patient's comfort. Ain't no way this man can tell more. <laughs> they were probably bold, yeah. And his assumably big house and hard body wife. I wish my wife was like that. Big old melons. <laughs> Just then, a droplet of water falls from the ceiling. My eyes trail it all the way down to the ground. I stared at the floor for some time, watching the carpet absorb the water. Suddenly, my attention is caught by a small, small child. The child was glaring directly at me. I saw the devil right back at me beneath his eyes. I got nervous and quickly stared directly at my feet as to not aggravate the child. That's when I noticed something. I was wearing two different kinds of socks. Golly, I'm all revved up after these thrilling in in exchanges. To be fair, you're a bit of a bore, but beggars can't be choosers. I think I'll stick around. I've got many a tale to tell. Nern Gun joined your party? No way! Honestly, his stories weren't that bad. They were bad, but like, at least he was funny. Smooth? Ah. Excuse me. You're blocking that 
jerky. Or something, I'm just assuming it's jerky. Oh, flip. No, no, I know it can work. I know it can work if I just put one foot out and one foot... I can't. It's impossible. He's just drunk. Oh, yeah. I mean, there are a lot of mold bodies in this so far, so... And a lot of blood. A bar. A hint. Bars. You can often find people for hire in bars. If you see a pink poster, you can access your party information for uh, when you want to spot party members. And, oh, that's good to know. Bars are great places. Maybe I can save in the bar. Okay. I have a little interest in scandalous magazines. I'm just looking for a stiff drink and a good memories. Okay. I don't want to hire anyone. Yo, what's happening, my man? You got a couple of mags for me? I'll run with your pack, brother. Energetic ex-pro wrestler known for his devastating headbutts. El Rage always puts the battle first and his health second. He has high speed and attack but somewhat low defense. I don't know how much I have. I'll be waiting, my man. Let's see. How do I know how- I only have four. I can't afford him yet. Maybe one day. A new party member. All right, I'm gonna do a little be right back. I need some water. That guy, that guy had me tr talking too much. <laughs>
I thought he was going for her boobs. <laughs> <laughs> Why is this so awkward? Um. Anyways. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> the pitter patter of her bare feet. <laughs> Where's her school bus? Oh, there it is. I got worried there for a second. All right, off to work. Coming. Oh. Some of the ears are so big in this game. I feel like if they were a little bit smaller, they'd be like cute. Alright, I like. I like. Alright, I'm gonna definitely gonna use Alpha for this one. So some cute ones. Oh no! <laughs> I tried. <laughs> oh, <it's>, <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> it's a tiny bit back heavy. <laughs> you step on it, deaf guy. Step on it. I'm trying. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Here, let me close as. You're welcome. You're welcome. Guys, we gave you all a fan. No need to thank us. Thank you. <laughs> Everyone gets a fan. The Sims 4, The Sims Free Play, and The Sims Mobile. You're welcome. Free fan. <laughs> that fan is. Uh, I, I, I don't like that fan. I think it's kind of ugly. <laughs> <sighs> This is one of those scams they say 100k prize, but they don't tell you what you own. Evil, like, scientists, you know what I mean? I feel like he likes, like, evil women. Does these make sense because of the poison? Yeah, that's true. But I mean, she's an evil scientist, so we could basically say whatever we want. <laughs> It was cool. the case. <laughs> no, 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 no. Okay, it's okay. We we won still. We won still. One v one each other uses practice. I would feel too bad. No, that would be so mean. Shows no mercy. <laughs> We did it! <laughs> Good job, everybody! Wow! Johnny has wings. But one of them died. <laughs> it's an old man. Oh my gosh. There were three fires. <laughs> three fires. I would never kill a sim. OMG. Do you think I am? <laughs> Come on, my darling. Climb on top. Uh, uh, climb onto the top. Aww. <laughs> I'm so cute. <laughs> Look, my brother didn't believe me, but this guy hurts me through the glass. Watch, I was over here. This is what was happening. He was hitting me like that. See, guys, I told he didn't believe me. Someone clipped that and sent that to my brother. <laughs> he 
was making fun of me. This thing killed me four times. I was devastated. Dead didn't you know where you- oh. I'm back. Thanks for waiting. Frosty didn't make you sound sus for once. <laughs> In a world of pain and puzzles, one hero returns. Death guy. Spider's chat has seen buckets of gasoline, trump water, decapitated illusions, and suspiciously repetitive God rest her soul. Is there foul play afoot? As they navigate Lisa's treacherous terrain, a new ally appears, Nern with a gun and a mysterious language barrier. Will they survive? Find out in the return of Death Guy. Oh, Lisa's <laughs> um, The Simpsons just killed off one of the oldest characters. I saw that! I saw that on Twitter! It was like a background character that's always at the bar. <laughs> um, we were in this one, right? Maybe we have to level up more before we, um, Um, go to the, the club. Nern, stop bleeding. Oh. The one super drunk dude who someone ends up back in the bar, even after he's thrown out? I don't think that's the one. I think it was just a guy who sits in the chair all the time. Sobered up, really? <gasps> Scared me. <laughs> you deal with it. Poncho. I got a new poncho. Can I wear it? Raid from <laughs> made from rabbit murder. <laughs> I don't have normal TV anymore. Oh. Oh, sorry. I don't think I've left season one with where I'm caught up, but I've seen some episodes from later seasons. Yeah, I used to watch it a lot because my dad would just put it on. Hi, Slowpoke! I'm the one good. Thanks for asking. How are you? Who shot Mr. Burns Part 2? <laughs> I have no idea. I hope you're having a great day, too. on the top. People think this girl's some kind of godsend. That ain't so. It's gonna tear us all apart. Listen here, brother. I got a stack of magazines with your name on it. Just need you to get me a, refer a refreshing bottle of liquor. I'll do it myself, but I'm all washed up. Okay, so if we get liquor bottle, we'll get a magazine and then we can hire that guy. Okay. Don't mind you going to spit on Hey. How do I get to the shop? Hello, 
old chum want to invest in a wonderful product it's really worth your time i don't have that much money you obviously don't know business sorry of course i gave all my stuff up for uh, our friend honestly i'm happier now that the world has ended it helps that my wife and kids are a guy. There's an abandoned building just down the way here. My friend and I are playing some cards in there. I just stepped out for some air, but you should join us. Sounds like a trap. But I feel safe because I just saved. <laughs> Cigarette. I got the joy, joy, joy down in my heart, down in my heart, down in my heart. Gosh, you're doing great. Today's a holiday here, so slept late. Hey, that's not great. I'm doing good. Gotta love one random dresser in the middle of nowhere ends up being a shop. Yeah. Uh, how about you? Oh, it's you. Your heart seems unhappy. Let's cheer it up. Remember to take care of yourself. I'll check up on you soon. Thank you. Iron Tiger Karate to build Muhammad's Iron Kar to Tiger Karate Center. Would you like to learn my Iron Tiger technique? It won't be easy. Sure. First of all, first a test. See that cliff over there? Yeah. You must fall off of it until I think you've proved your worth. Speak to me when you think you've proven yourself. Ugh.
You guys think I should do it? You think it's worth it? Is that enough? Not impressed yet. Keep going. times I have to do it. I wonder if it's it's a certain number of times or if it's a certain like health percentage I need to be at. Three hours later, I know, right? Well done. You've proven your power. Yay, a karate scroll. Make sure you read it. Okay. It's written in English. Can't be that authentic. Increases defense. Oh, he was part of that. He has the mask now. I should... What happened to that guy? What happened? Nern. Oh no, I forgot to revive Nern. Oh, he bit us. 
I shouldn't have started a fight with him. I should have just let the game... Oh, he, there's an item behind him, though. I see. I'm gonna go back. Okay. If I had to guess, I think that maybe this main character of this story is the sibling of the Lisa from the previous game? Heals poison. Oh, interesting. I'm gonna ignore that item. Maybe he was supposed to take care of her? He feels guilty about it? I don't think we could... I'm gonna backtrack and I'm gonna see if I can use that guy's tent or something. Maybe he's awake now. He's not awake. if we could give um that poncho to somebody i don't understand <laughs> maybe terry can wear it Where's a poncho? Oh, there we go. Okay. We- okay, let's sell his itchy poncho then. A dead flower? Hmm. Oh, maybe I should have put those items on before. Trollosaurus, how are you? It's going good. Oh, guys, by the way, I forgot to tell say that um this game actually is going to be free like in a week from now on uh on Epic. I saw it was going to be free on Epic. If you guys are interested. Glad you're good. Finish dinner time for some chill. Heck yeah. Do you guys remember where that shop was? Because I don't. <laughs> Guy, and then I get him in my party. Okay, 
Sounds loud. Don't be here. Is that better? Okay, thank you. In about 4.5 hours, it's free. Guys, mark your calendars. Put, put an alarm on your phone. I'm not really sure. I'm gonna be honest. I'm not really sure what to do next. I'm really intimidated by the hard fights. Also, I just really don't have any money. Alright, I'm gonna save again. And I'm just gonna pick one and just go on it. I'm just gonna pick one of these. What if I save the orphans this time? You think that would do something? Maybe they'll give me an item. I won't pour gasoline on the orphans this time. They won't let me. Oh no. I did it. I did it. I did the gasoline. He wouldn't let me get the water. The water was up here. So it wasn't my fault. It was his fault. He was the one who mixed up the, the buckets. Oh man. I thought I could save him. Look, if I wasn't there, the same thing would have happened because he would have grabbed the bucket. I'm just saying. They were criminals. <laughs> the one who kept lighting the fire was the criminal. I'm sure there's a way to get around this guy. Maybe I could escape. Oh, sorry. We shouldn't pour gasoline on a little fire. Thank you. 
<laughs> They're fine, guys. They're fine. Get him, guys. Get him. TP is. if I should try it. I can't even use it. bottle item. See, he heals. That's the problem. A lot. He heals them a lot. Also, I have no idea what his health is. <laughs> Maybe I should throw another bottle. I wish I knew how much health they had. Yeah, he did. <laughs> mm. Terry's good at throwing, I have to say. This look is the same it is, isn't it? It does kind of look like that. on him. I don't know how important it is to get past this guy, so I'm just throwing everything at him and seeing what happens. Because it seems to me it seems like the plot will move forward if I could get if I could just get past him. unsinkable like the Titanic. Oh, we did it! Ooh. Level up. Oof, that was hard. I don't know if I should... I'm gonna save, but I'm gonna save on a different one, just in case that wasn't worth using up all of our items for. Thank you! Just in case. Did I say something weird? I don't want to. Don't tell me. I always say weird things by accident. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> Hello? Don't even think about trying to make that jump. You're way too fat and dull looking. Get a bike, dude. Lose a couple pounds. A bike? Would that really help? Wait, guys. How do I get across that? Wait. Alright, so I'm starting to think that maybe it wasn't worth fighting that guy so early on. Because I need to get a bike anyway to get to the next part. <laughs> okay. The Fall Guys movie's coming out soon, right? Is that real? I think I'm gonna go with this one. I think I'm that even though we won the fight, I'd use too many items and we can't get past it anyway, so I'm just gonna deal with it later when we're stronger. It'll probably be easier. Okay, so new plan. I wanna see if I can get past this gang without having to fight them. Ryan Gosling as the fall. <laughs> <laughs> oh, some someone was in here. <laughs> oh my gosh, creepy. I think I could escape. I mean, I felt this thing before. wondering if maybe if I don't know it, it seemed it just I think I'm just getting lucky and it's missing a lot of things I thought maybe it was like passive shout out to all my fans <laughs> well the more fights we get into the more money we make Alright, I'm gonna... Yo! Where are you going? Get over here! Hey Lance, leave him alone! Randall doesn't want to start any stuff for no reason. I said get over here now. See, last time I kept I ignored him and then I got attacked by everybody, so maybe if I go back because he just wants to chat. Got any business here? Should I say I'm looking for someone or I'm just- I'm, I'm gonna say I'm just passing by. Just get out of here. Oh no. It's gonna start the fight again? You deaf, this place ain't for school. Oh, they want me to go. Oh, I see. They wanted me to go the other way. I mean, maybe I can win. Probably not. I died really quickly last time. if there's a way to like befriend them almost like just be more friendly and they'll let me buy <laughs> I 
I can't beat them to death. They beat me to death. Um... I'm gonna try one more time. I'm gonna say- I'm gonna use the other, uh, dialogue option. It was... this one? Heal. Should try to stun him. Oh, got him. Just look, I'm looking for someone. Everybody's looking for her. I'll ask you why you're here is Rando's turf. <laughs> I'll just say, I don't want any trouble. Okay, I'm leaving. At least we got the money from fighting that ghost. Or shadow. Another one? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you know what that means? More money. No, I'm not. You guys. You got Terry can't attack my poor my poor Terry. <laughs> Yay. We got a mystery jerky too. Oh, we could take him. We could take him. <laughs> I'll fight ghosts all day. <laughs> Dang. I'll try to stun him. It's, I, I noticed that it's harder to stun these guys, so I'm just not even gonna bother. Creepy ghost. Ooh, fireball. What the heck? You can shoot a fireball? Not the lick. Mm, 
I probably should have saved after the heal. But they said sometimes you get attacked when you're sleeping, so. I'm saving again. Alright, wait. I can't keep track. This one was... That's that really... <laughs> that snake, I can't beat that snake. <laughs> this was where all the shops were, right? This is where the gang was. This is where we need the bike. Okay. Just gotta f keep looking around here, I think. Is it possible to go down? Oh, yeah. What is this? Secret stash? Ten magazines. Oh, I wonder if I could, um, hire that guy now. If I had a bike, I could get up there too, I think. Hmm. I'll try. Drink. How much is this guy? <laughs> 70. Okay, hold on. We have 45. I'm gonna see what happens when we uh, give this guy a drink. Fantastic. What's your story, bald man? I'm looking for someone. Seems a lot of people have been doing that recently. Anyone specific? I should go. Hold on. I don't want to pry into your business, but you got another thing coming. If you think you can do this on your own, war's going on. You're going to need allies. Besides, I owe you a drink. Generally reserved man. Handles his bow as well as he handles his liquor. Superbly. Sounds good to me. Yeah! It worked, guys. I thought I had to give him a magazine. <laughs> Yay! Bam, bam. Hmm. I'm gonna go through all the doors again. These were just houses, I think. Yeah, these were just houses. That was the guy that was looking for a drink. I don't have one for him, though. Fine. I wonder what this room is for. What was that? Yay, we have another person. Hmm. Oh yeah, this is where... Okay, that was like a dead end. Let's see. 25 now. We have 25. say I'm stuck, but I think I'm a little stuck. Maybe we could try to beat the snake again. Maybe we could do it now. I'm gonna check over here real quick. Get on top? 
no. Okay, so bug. Maybe I should have sold them. <laughs> oh wait, the max- I'm dumb, they're the currency. I'm gonna try. Oh wait, the snake was a random encounter? Oh. What's that? It's a guy. Just left. It's one of those snakes! I hope I could get him. Bite so hard. And maybe it's just luck then. It's loose. The snake bears its fangs. <gasps> Ugh. Actually, here, let me do this. Yeah. He's poisoned. He's a cigarette then. It's not that bad. Ah, oh, flip. These snakes are tough. I'll throw a bottle at him. <laughs> I just don't know how much health he has left. Oof, uh... He could have had like one point left. I don't I have no idea. Nothing. We got nothing from that snake. I hope we don't have a another snake battle. A fire. Brad. New strain of tuberculosis in my room. <laughs> Taking a break from the chaos of the new strain of tuberculosis, huh? Enjoy the lurking and stay safe. <laughs> 
Brad, wake up, wake up, Brad. Brad, it's important. Something I remembered about Olaf. Something about our past. There you are. Now that you're awake, I must remind you. It's mighty rude to fall asleep in the middle of a conversation, Brad. Next time, just tell me if you're tired. I'm sure I'll surely understand. I'm not one for wasting people's time. Ho ho. More importantly, I was getting to the point of everything we discussed earlier tonight. I have a theory, Brad. Based on all my research, and based on the fact that we know at least one female still exists, or should I say, is alive, for now, I suppose. Based on all this, I believe that women... And by the way, before you pass any judgment, I have to add that I've done a ton of research. Life after the Flash has been totally surreal. Honestly, none of this makes any sense. And the more I hang around you, Brad, the worse it gets. <laughs> I'm really starting to wonder if you've taken so many of those drugs that you're starting to become a drug yourself. I started to see and feel very weird things around you. Scary. But hard to resist, I must say. In fact, I'm starting to notice that the light reflects off your shiny head in the same way it reflects off the joy pill. <laughs> Could this be a connection? Or is it just how light reflects off perfectly round surfaces? Hmm. We always think we're going to get some kind of lore from this guy. We Sorry, Brad. I got lost in thought. All this mysticism and speculation is beneath you. Dry, plain, direct information. That's what you're all about. I knew I pinned you right as a history buff, my boy. And history waits for no one. Recording history, learning from history, building a whole society is off tales of facts. Sometimes fiction. That's why it's more important than ever to discuss and record these wild times. If only the wasteland had some type of magazine of information. Oh, wow. I just had a serious mind blast. Do you remember newspapers, Brad? I do. I never read them, but I did always keep them. <laughs> the fact that I collected them. Do you know why? Do you know why, Brad? You'll never guess, but I'll give you a chance. Coupons, Brad. I love coupons. I mean, heck, it's why I married my through suck sucking wife in the first place. God rest her soul. She loves coupons almost as much as me. He's a hoarder. I had stacks and stacks of newspapers, all full of coupons. Each newspaper had anywhere from one to five coupons in each issue, and newspapers came once a week. On a good month, you could net 25 to 200 coupons a month if you factored in my private hoard. I'll tell you what, bratty boy. I could have just one thing from before the flash. Just one thing? It would be newspapers. I would wake up out of the campfire with a tight wad little newspaper all rolled up, just waiting for me, squeezed together by a bouncy rubber band that's just barely too tight. Pages ready to burst out, coupons begging to be drenched in my penny pinching gaze. Golly, I trade the filthiest of mags for one last newspaper. Hell, I cut my own arm off for a newspaper. Maybe both of them. Oh, gracious me. I had so many dailies. Oh, right. You're uninitiated. Us in the CDC. Coupon collecting community. <laughs> we would call newspapers dailies for short. Newsies. Papers. Newspaps. The rag. The weeklies. Hmm. The news. And for coupons, we would call them clips. Clippies, clippings, discount documents, thrift tickets, bargain bills, illegal license to loot, certifications to save. Those folks taught me a lot about couponing. I'm embarrassed to admit, but did you know I would go to supermarket? I would bring all my newspapers from home. I fill a whole cart with just newspapers, full of coupons every, every time I went. One day, a woman came up to me while I was shopping and handed me a pair of scissors and said, you should buy these scissors. In my head, I said, you should mind your own business. And in the moment, I ended up saving, saying, shut the F up, you scissor peddling hag. Can't you see I'm busy having a bad day? 
She ignored that and took the time to explain to me that I could clip the coupons and leave the worthless newspaper behind. Wow, what a woman. I ended up marrying her. <laughs> Turns out you could be rude to whoever you want and still find love. You just need to keep being mean until you find a special someone patient enough to tolerate it. What I'm saying is, well... Um, hey, sorry, Brad, it's just... My eyes have adjusted to the dark now and, well, not to be rude, but you have a lot of blood on you, in your beard and on your clothes, and you smell like blood too. It's just, it, it reminds me of a childhood friend, Rodney Donkhausen, Red Rod we called him. Or was it Rad Rod? That's right, Rad Rod, because his ha red hair was so radical. I have so many great stories about that goof, but those will have to wait for another time. All this back and forth ha got me tuckered out. <laughs> I should get some rest. <laughs> Good thinking, Brad. Getting some winks in, too. Sleep is important. Why in the four times I rest 13, 17 hours a day? Of course, that was back when. Mahogany. What was I just talking about? Oh yeah, Rad Rod. Rude and red he was. Just like my slop slipping coupon clipping. I swear, if we get killed by a snake right after this, and I did that whole cutscene for nothing... Oh my gosh. By Fork Knight's heaving boss bosom, what is that? Ah, sorry Brad, I swear, I just felt a spider crawling up on my face. Must have been a twitch of the old mustache whiskers. You know, I'm surprised you're still awake, Brad. Well, since you're having trouble turning in anyway. Oh no, I suppose you wouldn't mind hearing just a bit more about old Roddy, would you? I remember. It was like 40-something years ago. And it was. Rod shook me awake, big mane of red hair whipping to and fro. Oh boy, he shouted, shaking like a leaf blower. I found it. How the world got so arsed up. He's too close to my face, mind, and by, and the way he's talking is annoying me. Kind of erratic. And what kind of person says arsed in the heat of the moment? Arse. See? Feels weird for me to say, even now. Plus, I could feel his spittle on my smooth chin. I couldn't have shaved that day. I shouldn't have shaved that day. Not that I could ever grow much of a beard. Anyway, obviously, this has got me intrigued. His hair being so long, I mean, how did he do that? I'll admit it, I've always been jealous of a good mop. Sturdy follicles, follicles escaped me, even then. And that rascally Rod knew it. That wasn't the first time he'd shoved those thick strands in my face like that. Hmm. Now, we're, when was the first time? Must have been 20 or 50 years ago. Who's really counting? Just picture yourself as a child. 5, 6, 26 years old. Who's really counting? Just picture a much younger Brad. Now that you're in a childhood, childlike state of mind, picture me as a child, exactly eight and a half years old, wrinkleless and energetic I was. It was the summer of 80, 90, summer of 98? 
son of an FD had it be? What year was it? Ah, oh, forget it. It's not like... I'm not big on details anyway. You're just gonna have to deal with that, Brad. Now please, don't interrupt me. Where was I? Oh, right. It was my first time going to Red Rod's house. Now, <laughs> I was the kind of kid who usually kept to himself, you know. Never been best at talking with people. Can't come up with enough to say, you understand? But I work up the courage at that point to brave a sleepover. So I get over to Rodster's place, and I knock three times, but it was not isn't my pal who answered the door. Well, I thought it was Rod at first, the mess of ginger on top, but the hair kept flowing down. Long, beautiful locks. By golly. It was some kind of foxy bait. A tomato-headed slice of juicy fruit. <laughs> or is it a vegetable? Are tomatoes fruits or vegetables? Either way, she was a seven. Maybe even an eight if she came with some garlic bread. Hair so saucy you could eat it. <laughs> that was that red hot redhead Rod's snack of a sister or his dish of a mom. <laughs> It's one of the mysteries I ponder in the rare moments I get to myself these days. <laughs> but you can bet your spaghetti she showed up in my dreams that night. <laughs> that is, until Red Rod, the carrot top bastard, <laughs> shook me awake in the middle of the night, exactly like how you interrupted my sleep just now to talk about your discounts and ginger and girls and chunk. He kept babbling on about seeing the polka dot man right outside his window. He was so close to my face, I couldn't bear it. Our prepubescent whiskers were practically touching. The stench of his dumb kid breath sent tinkles to disgust down my spine. What's that? Don't remember the polka dot man? The old urban legend about the greasy guy in the suit creeping around at night? Yeah, he had polka dot tie or something. Who cares? That's not the point. The point is, it was just typical radical Rodney. Imagine you're trying to sleep and you have to listen to this uh, uh, dying for attention. That's why we called him needy. He always had to be the focal point. Constantly. Embellishing things. Oh my god, I'm getting so busy. People like that, I swear. This guy's exhausting me. Anyway, Brad. All this com camaraderie is nice and all. But I'd appreciate it if you respect my time a bit more going forward. Wow. That was exhausting. You don't feel very well rested. I do not. Not in the game and not in real life. Now I'm going to get attacked by snakes. Look at it smile. Disgusting. I've watched this beast kill dozens. Yet at this moment, I could just sit here and stare into its eyes. And just stares back, smiling. But you don't- you want to kill it, don't you? You need something explosive. Firebombs, perhaps. And some good men. Then you may stand a chance. Oh no, there's the bike, guys! No, I don't have explosives. And I'm poisoned. The snake got me. Oh no. I never got gasoline. To make a bomb. I'm stressing. I'm stressing, guys. Should we try? Why can't I just walk around him? Because we live in a 2D world, that's why. I don't want to go back because I don't want to get attacked by another snake. It was brutal out there. We got five empty bottles to throw. I don't have any explosives. Should we try? I'm scared.
have skills now? <laughs> he could attack. He's weirded out. Okay, that wasn't too bad so far. We can attack now, guys. <laughs> he bit, he bit Curry. He bit Curry. Yeah, I bought this guy a drink and he just joined my team. He bit Terry and killed him in one bite. Oh my gosh. Ah. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, he bit us. Burn. Burn. Can we leave? We're not gonna win. I'm scared. Oh my gosh, that was. Uh, I hate it. 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 Oh, fire is good against him. That for nothing. All right, now we know what's on the other side though of the field. All right, so this is what we we need gasoline. We need gasoline to make a bomb to kill that guy, so we could get the bike, so we could kill that other guy, and then go across and then go to the club. Okay, where do we get gasoline from? Hi Musa, where are you? 4.40 a.m. What are you doing? Actually, it's 12.15 for me. I'm in the UK for two months. I'm trying to find gasoline. What if instead of killing the orphans, I just steal that guy's gasoline? You think I could do that? <laughs> I'm glad you're good. I'm the one good. Thanks for asking. What if I... Okay, guys, yeah. What if I don't kill the orphans? I steal their gasoline. That's the only gasoline I've seen so far. And I can make a bomb. No, take the bucket. I need it. Look, the orphans are still alive, guys. We're fine. We're on the good timeline. I need that gas. 
Dang it. Dang it. The only gasoline within miles is in there. Hmm. Maybe now that I have a fourth guy, we could defeat that, um... No, they, they just hit so hard, that gang. I can't get past the gang. Hmm. I think I'm a little stuck. There must be some easy solution here that I'm not thinking of. The timeline. Well, the orphans are alive still. <laughs> they didn't die in a fire. Yet. Oh, snake. No reason to go there. We don't have a bomb yet. Okay, we need to... I'm gonna write this down. I'm gonna write this down because I'm gonna play this next week again. And I don't want to forget. So we need... Gasoline. To make... Bomb. Go to snake place. Get bike. Go to... That's, the snake is the little hole. Go to the middle. Defeat guy. Then ride bike. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm Google on my phone about this ga how to acquire gasoline. I'm a little stuck here. And I'm gonna use the uh, power of modern technology to find out to get a hint. <laughs> get gasoline. Maybe I could buy a bomb, guys. I know how to get gas, guys. It, that guy. It was that guy. Mm -mm. Guys, I'm so confused. This way. Not this way. Maybe this way. The first one. Nope, nope. Oh shoot, I didn't know I'd go this way. Oh, I don't have a bike, I can't do that. I don't know why I thought I could do that. <laughs> one okay i have two ideas guys i have two ideas one maybe i could buy a bomb two defeat that guy i don't i only think that because someone said how to get gasoline and then i saw a picture of that this guy this one right here see maybe that's gasoline right behind him hmm. all right let's give it a shot likes to weird us out. Remember when he had that skill before? That was weird. He must have leveled and then we lost the level when we res when we died.
Bleh. He's one of those one bite guys. Okay, I see. Maybe not. Oh shoot, we did it. Terry. Whoa, we all leveled. Trash bag. Okay, well. Mm. A shawl made out of a trash bag. Let's see. Who uses a shawl? The deep S deep goes down. What about Nern? Oh, they have the same exact one? Same exact one. I'll give it to him. Okay, well that didn't that was not super helpful, I don't think. Okay, next idea. Store. Buy it in the store. head off to work. Thank you for the stream. Good luck. Have fun and great day. Thank you, Soap Poke. Have a good day. Thank you for the hydrate. Thanks for hanging. We have 35 now. Do I really need these? how rich we are now. Mm. We could buy a new shirt for uh, Terry. Let's check out that other shop real quick. Oh, wait a minute. I forgot to see if there's different categories. Right. Buy... Oh no, it's only he only has four items, okay. I sold all of our drugs. Where was that other shop? I think it was over here. Yeah, yeah. Well, hi. Um, okay, so no... Gasoline or bombs. We could get a better gun for Nern. And a better bow for Olan. I think I might do that. I'll just get a better gun for now. And then let's, uh, we'll sell the old one. <laughs> I 
Okay, and then we'll buy this. <laughs> Only four? Okay. I don't think we needed the drugs. I'm gonna be honest. Okay, here, let me look a little bit. How much time do I have? Like an hour? Get, I want a bomb. Randomly can be found in presence when camping at unsafe spots. Oh. I think I'm just not far at all into the game. I used all the firebombs on the mutant who guards the bicycle. That's what I'm trying to find. Yeah, everyone join my Minecraft server. Doopy doo boom ba doom boom. I'm cheating. I don't care. Get past Rando's men. Ah. You don't need fire bombs to kill him. Someone go stop overthinking. I'm stuck. It's not my fault. Not my fault. I'm an idiot. I'm good to save because I got new weapons. The new weapons will make us win. I'll try to defeat that gang again. It's gonna be like my third attempt. I don't know. They seem to hit really hard though. Also guys, this game's gonna- just so you know, just so you guys know, this game's gonna be free in the Epic Store, okay? Go get it. Ah! A ghost again. I forgot Carrie's Terry. <laughs> Terry's knocked out. I can't. Drop kick. New attack. I wonder if I rest if he will be unknocked out. I should try that. Or if I need to use perfume every time someone gets knocked out. Man. I'm going back, I'm going back. I'm gonna try to go in the tent. I'm going back, I'm going back. Okay now. He is okay. Cool. Good to know. That's like an interesting mouse type character, huh? The 
The the one in the dark. <gasps> oh my gosh, it scared me. Alright, do we have the confidence, guys? Attack Terry, please don't. Maybe we should go for the one in the middle first. I don't know. I think our defense is a lot better than last time. Pixels, who are you? <laughs> Thank you, Terry. Probably should do some more powerful attacks, huh?
Got him. I'm going back and I'm healing. I'm going back. That was crazy. I like that all these, uh... Oh, thank you! That's new! Okay, death guy. I like that all these enemies that I was having a really hard time with before, they're all easy now. Well, maybe not easy, but I'm getting by them a lot easier. Let me save first. Okay, and then I'm gonna... Because so they said sometimes you could get attacked when you're sleeping. Seen this game before, but I never would have imagined you playing this. I played the first one a long time ago, but I didn't expect the second. I didn't expect the game to be like this. Welcome back. Oh yeah, it's dark. I forgot. I was like, it's taking a long time to load. <laughs> Come at me, ghosts. we'll find some gasoline then we'll make a bomb then we'll beat that guy then we'll get a uh a bike and then we could get to the club Just go in there for the heck of it. Always oh, listen to the radio. I won't disturb him. I go down. <sighs> oh. 
Oh, oh, there's a floor down there. Oh no. My name is Treat Sneety. I'm a treasure hunter. Rumor has it that this cave has some sig loot hidden in it, but I just can't find it. Oh. Firebombs! Guys! We did it! How to get up there. I'll see what this is. Cigarette? Oh, probably like this. bigger one. Don't mess with my corpse. I wasn't planning on it. Oh. I saw what you did over there to the boys, and I don't want none of that. I'll tell you something good, if you just leave me alone. Alright, tell me. Hairspray is very flammable. That's good advice. <laughs> People with a lot of product in their hair are flammable. Thanks. Um, is there a crack in the ground I should be able to use? I think I should be able to go there. Oh, shoot. My bad. I was trying to see if there's anything hidden. was the last thing we did.
Should I beat that person again, you think? Or nah? I guess it's not bad. It's experience. Talk to him again. Oof. I did this already, right? I wonder how I get to that one. Is that- I wonder if that's even worth it. Probably not. Now how do I get to the top? Maybe it doesn't matter. Did I try walking all the way, uh, to the right? There's the crack, I think. Let's try. The worst thing about being there being no women is that there will be no more kids. you find us. You must be a pretty smooth guy. I like that. Thanks. <laughs> Wanna sleep here, buddy? I'll watch over you for ten magazines. Um, no thank you. I'm okay. I'm not... Uh, yeah, I'm okay. Maybe later. our boss. He's inherited this gang from his brother. He thinks the name is lame, so he acts tough. But we're harmless. <gasps> Ooh, uh, did I almost fall? Are those the schoolboy shufflers? Mess with us, and you get the slip, pal. And I ain't talking detention. Wow. I'm honestly surprised you even found us in here. You must be really awesome at adventuring and stuff. Hmm. Tell you what. Randall's army has set up camp here to find that girl. They'll cut off our links to the outside. If you could clear out all Randall's guys in this area, I'll let you pass. Beyond this point is the only generator within miles. It's loaded with gasoline, and you look like the kind of guy that sniffs gas. So, this is, the, this is right up your alley. How about it? Kill the rando guys? Rock and roll. I think there's about four guys roaming in the caves around here. Come back when they're all dead. I don't think I'm gonna do that. Maybe. I'll write a note. I'll write a note, maybe.
I'm just afraid I might if I if I try to continue this game next week I might forget something, so I'm trying to write everything down. Was he one of the guys we're supposed to kill? I see. Guess I could take a longer nap now. Pose, nice. I was hoping we get bombs off of him. Oh well, I guess we got one of them. One of them. I was just wanted to talk to him out of curiosity. Mince wrap. I don't know that game. I'm gonna... Let me see. I'm gonna backtrack. I'm gonna backtrack and heal. Or... Hmm, should I pay that guy? You think the gasoline's worth it? I just feel bad killing people. But I guess that's video games for you. I'm gonna use the 10 for the... the tent, and then I'll try to kill those guys. No, but that means I have to kill that guy too. Hmm. What is that? I'm thinking. What I'm thinking, eh? What time is it for me? Oh, I gotta go soon. Alright, maybe I'll maybe I'll just backtrack and I'll go to the um that tent the free tent. And then I'll head off for today. I gotta start working soon. Kill <laughs> count. <laughs> No ghost attacks, please. Yay! Oh, <laughs> That's okay. Makes you feel really cool, but you're not. I 
feel safe with the soup guy next to me, you know? Although someone knocked him out like a week ago and he's still laying there. Hope he's okay. I'm gonna delete this one. So I don't accidentally load it. Okay. Let me see. Um, how do I get back? Let's see. Where's my Twitch? I don't want to raid somebody. Okay, let's see. <laughs> let's raid animals again. <laughs> They're cute. Guys, thanks for hanging with me. Um, where's my... Where are you guys? Uh, yeah, hang with Discord if you want. Chill. Discord. I'm gonna make a schedule. Have a great day. Thanks for hanging. Bye, guys.